Hey, what's up? In this video, I want to tell you about another projector. It is called AcroJoy SunSpark 500W. The main features of this projector are compact size, HD native resolution, 9000 lumens brightness, and Wi Fi connection. You know, when I received this product, I thought it was a kid's projector because of its small size. However, it is really good projection quality. Later in this video, I will show you video samples in the dark room and the bright room. But now, let's start the review with unboxing. By the way, did you hit the bell icon to receive notifications about the new videos on our channel, Tech Brothers? If not, then you can do this right now. The box of the new AcroJoy projector looks like this. As you can see, the main features of this model are screen mirroring, Wi-Fi connection and a tripod included. Inside the box we have a projector itself, remote control, tripod, HDMI cable, power cable and user manual. First, I'm glad that HDMI cable is included. Many other projectors don't have HDMI cable in the package, but I think it is a basic way of connection. And then uh, there is a tripod in the package. It makes a projection more stable. As already said, one of the main features of AcroJoy SunSpark 500W is compact size. For comparison, we tested another Full HD projector yesterday. You can see that AcroJoy device is much smaller. Its dimensions are 200 x 155 x 85 mm. The weight is only 930 grams. A new projector has control buttons on the top, such as source, return, left, ok, right, and power. There are also focus and keystone correction wheels. On the front we can see a lens and I.O. receiver. The second I.O. receiver and air inlet are on the back. On the left side there is an air inlet, 3.5mm audio jack, AV port, TF card slot, HDMI port, USB port and VGA. A speaker is located on the right side. We can also look at the bottom. There are 4 feet, kickstand and a tripod mount. I am very surprised how the manufacturer managed to make such a compact projector with good specifications. Ok, we can turn on a new projector and look at user interface. On the main screen of interface, we can go to the media, source, mirror cast, iOS cast and setup. In the media we have 4 sections, such as movie, music, photo and text. But you need to connect USB flash drive or TF memory card. Then we can choose a source, there is HDMI, VGA and AV sources available. Here we also have image and sound settings. To be honest, I don't quite understand why these options are in the sources, but not in the settings. Anyway, you can change the image mode, aspect ratio, brightness, contrast, color, sharpness and digital zoom. In the sound settings, we can choose a sound mode. Finally, in the top menu, we can connect to Wi-Fi network, change projection mode and advanced settings, such as language, boot source, sleep timer, iOS play mode, local update, online update and restore factory default. You know, a user interface of this projector looks like Android. It is very intuitive and user-friendly. Now I want to test a Wi-Fi connection. I will try to connect my iPhone to projector via Wi-Fi. First, you need to connect the projector to your home Wi-Fi network. For that, go to Setup menu and then choose Network, Wi-Fi and Scan. Here you will find your Wi-Fi network. After that, you need to go to iOS Cast menu if you want to connect an iPhone or MirrorCast if you connect Android device to projector. Now you can take your smartphone and select projector in the screen mirroring menu. That's all. AcroJoy SunSpark 500W has a 3 watt built in speaker. I want to check its quality and maximum volume. You know, a speaker is really loud and it is pretty good quality. As for the noise level of the new projector, it is about 41 dB near projector. And 34 dB at a distance of 1 meter. That's very good. I have installed a projector in my bedroom. 
The distance from the wall to projector is about 3.5 meters. I think that screen size is about 120 inches. In the user manual we can see a ratio of distance and projection size. The maximum screen size can be 240 inches. The native resolution of AcroJ projector is 1280 by 720 pixels. From a distance, the picture looks very good, but closer we can see individual pixels. Moreover, the visible pixels make the image look too sharp at a close range. The edges of projection are not blurred. The contrast ratio is 8000 to 1. The colors are really bright. As for the brightness, the manufacturer says it is 9000 lumens. I cannot check this, because I don't have a special device to test the brightness, but a little later I will show you a projection in a bright room. It is really good. The case is made of metal, and the manufacturer says that it is more stable and durable than the plastic one. Best of the new Regi smartphone from Umedici on our channel, Tech Brothers. And this is the last video about Umedici Best on X10. We will talk about pros and cons of this phone. Friends, I found it to be a bit difficult to hold it in one hand for a long time. Now, it's not a real candy store, that would be bad for my teeth, right? This you know, I believe that this projector has 9000 lumens brightness, because the image in a bright room is good. You can even watch movies in daytime. You know, the native resolution of AcroJoy SunSpark 500W projector is HD, but the image quality is really good. I think this is because of high brightness. The maximum projection size is 240 inches, but I cannot even imagine it. I also like a user-friendly interface, and it is very easy to connect to Wi-Fi network. So AcroJoy SunSpark 500W is a good compact and quiet projector for home theater or even office. Thank you for watching this video. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel, Tech Brothers.